Hello everyone, welcome to our Krav Maga class. I'm Owen Malul, I'm a Krav Maga and fitness expert, and today we're gonna to teach you guys some effective and practical self-defense moves. Okay guys, so today we're gonna to be handling a defense against a knife threat. Okay, it looks like this. Neil, come here. Knife threat. Come down, come down. Take my wallet. <laughs> We have to understand that it's not a stab. It's not a knife stab. He could actually already stab me if he wanted. He got close to me and he wants something from me. He wants my money. He wants me to come with him somewhere. Whatever he wants me to do. Now, of course, we don't have to teach you guys. If you could give your money, give your money. If you could get out of it alive without risking your life, that's the best thing you could do. But I'm talking about a situation that I know I'm going to be kidnapped or there's a real danger on my life. What do we do? First step, lift those hands up. Whoa, come down, come down. That means get your hands close to the danger, close to the threats. But it's important to do it wisely. Don't do it here. Because <laughs> here you're getting in trouble. You need to get the hands below the threat. No, come down, come down. Distract him, give, give, give him your wallet, give him your phone. Second step, redirect the threat. So here we have what's called the reverse concept. If the knife comes from here, I have to redirect it exactly to the other side. Boom, reverse. First step, second step, redirect. Now, one arm, as we said last class, is not enough. I have to add right away another arm and getting it close to my body. So if he pulls my hand, boom, I'm coming with him. I want to go with two hands and to put him in a lock in a very smart way. So pay attention to what I do. Lift your hands. My right hand is going to redirect towards my left, pushing and locking him with the left hand holding my own and getting it close to the body. Now, if he's pulling me, he's gonna be pulling me and he's gonna have a very hard time to pull the knife. And while he's pulling me, I go, oh, knee, or I go kick, pull, boom. After a couple of counter attacks, when the knife is with me, I'm confident, my time is to disarm him. So what I do, I rotate my body, rotate my left elbow, turn towards my right shoulder and put pressure on his, boom, pay attention, on his elbow, wiping the ground and actually falling. <laughs> now pay attention what I have here. I have him on his stomach and I'm pulling and putting very strong pressure on his elbow, oh. easily could break his elbow and now all I gotta do is just take the knife, run away. First step, we said bring the hands closer to the danger, but don't scare him. Don't do whoa. Yeah. Now the hand, right? Just yeah. The, the, like the, the opposite hand. If I threaten my right, you're gonna do it with also with the right. That means not the parallel hand, the mm -hmm. opposite hand. So also with the right. Grab Boom like this. and redirect. Wait, wait. You to grab is not enough. You have to redirect it and right away push it to, towards your left elbow, put him in a lock. You're gonna hold your own, yeah, here, your own arm. Stick it to your body, pull it to your body. Oh yeah, don't, don't bend, be straight, yeah. Now here, here, even I, I try to stab you, I'm having a very hard time. So if I'm pulling, hold it tight to your body. If I'm pulling, oh, and I'm pulling you to my knee, to your, oh, knee. The last step is to rotate. Yep, good job. Now pull this arm a little bit. Pull with this arm here so you get my elbow. Oh, yeah. Now here too, yeah, here you pull, you put pressure on my elbow. Here what you gotta do. Imagine you wipe, you wipe the ground. You wipe the ground and then you kind of fall down. Oh, oh I start here, yeah, but don't fall like here. Look, what do you really imagine? You fall. Going to this arm, boom, pull it, pull it, go up, yeah, up, oh, there you go. Thank you guys for joining our Krav Maga class. 
I'm Orin Malul, and remember, a single move can save your life.